the little catch because on the receipt I noticed there was the actual carrier bag on there as well so I thought okay let's deduct what the carrier bag was and the total came to help everybody welcome back to my channel my name is dan if you are new here then please hit that subscribe button give it a thumbs up and any comments you have just drop them in the comment box down below uh, a few weeks ago me and a lovely youtuber named michelle osgood agreed to collaborate together if you don't know who michelle is click over to her channel i'll link that in the description box down below basically it's similar to mine uh she does a lot of hauls she does how to she does uh, DIY. I love her channel because you just don't know what videos you're going to get. Um, so basically, click over to her channel now. Uh, this is a collaboration with Michelle. Uh, so what we agreed was that we would do a haul from based on good old home bargains. Uh, and we literally have a 20 item challenge. Uh, so it's basically 20 items but no more than £15 spend so basically there's a few little catches where you just couldn't get the same item you could get the same item but you could get maybe like a different scent or something but you just couldn't get two of that same item uh, so I went yesterday and I thought it would be quite easy but I, can't, I kind of found it as a challenge because also you just can't literally add it up on your phone or um, use calculator you just got to grab it as you go and well that that was my plan anyway so and I basically got stuff that I probably would I, I would use so I just didn't go into home bargains getting the cheapest items I got the items that I would probably use and, and need so yeah so like I say um 20 items uh, to the value of 15 pound or under now if we both achieve that 15 pound and under then the winner would basically be the one who got the uh, paid the least at the till so without further ado stick around to the end of the video to see who come out best and like I say click over to her channel like she's got a great channel um, love Michelle she's a nice girl as well a bit like myself but the male version so but anyway without further ado guys let us get on into that video. So what Danny would do, I'll uh, I'll add the uh, amount of each item here, uh, and then I'll change the price as I go out throughout the video. Now, I will say, I will have to add a tiny bit of money onto this amount, but all will come clear at the end of the video of the reason why. So the first item out of the 20 is, um, now I have these anyway, um, and basically these are the uh, Nutribix. These, I saw these in Sainsbury's yesterday and they were £3.99 and they only had, sorry about the glare, I'm facing the window because uh, my uh, tripod's broke. But anyway, these was £1, guys, £1 and they have uh, three different flavours. Um, these I think like gluten free but they're so expensive in supermarkets but like I say these were just a pound so I picked those up there then my second item um, I've only just got into like um, toothpicks and stuff so I saw these uh, and you get six in there and they were 59 pence for these so this is the second item uh, 59 pence I was going to pick some up from Asda and they were asking for about three uh, three pound plus for these so these were the 59 pence uh, a third item uh, soap just some dental soap I'm going to try and use soap uh, just as like a bit of a backup uh, in the shower uh, and this is um, this is a sensitive so this is antibacterial as well it's a dental and this was 50 55 pence so sorry about the, the glare guys yeah 59 pence for the third item and then toothpaste always like to have like a backup in toothpaste uh, so i bought the mclean's one and anything with white on it i'll buy helps a little bit how much was this uh this was 79 pence for this one so pick that up as well and then the fifth item, uh, water, little bottle of water, and this has got 
try and do it on this way. Uh, cucumber water. Now, I hate cucumber, but if it's healthy, it's water. I don't think it's going to be too bad. Um, so, that was 19 pence per bottle. So, I was going to only get the one. Uh, so, pick that one up as well. Then, the sixth item, guys, was I need another little baking tray. So, this will come in handy. Uh, and this is non-stick. The one I've got at the moment, I'm literally peeling every bit of bloody tin foil off it soaking it so i literally needed a, a non-stick one and this was 49 pence for this item so fairly small but do for me like a chicken or something uh so we've got one two three four five six now the seventh item is I get the blue versions of these and I didn't know they had the pink version. So these are the toilet blocks. Um, so it would be cool to see how they come out with uh, pink water. Uh, and you get three in a pack. Um, these are the actual blue ones, three in a pack. And these are only 99p for free. So didn't know they did the pink ones. So pick that one up as well. Um, I'm forgetting what item number I'm on, so I'll probably just whack it on the top part of the screen, or it's probably already on there. Uh, and then the next item is some Star Drops. Uh, home bargains have so many different varieties of Star Drops, um, but this is just basically kitchen spray with bleach. Um, so I'll just pick this one up because it's all day use, so it's uh, 89 pence that one was as well. I literally got around to the store and I have had, I think I had 15 items in my bag, in my basket, and I thought, I'm doing really well. And then uh, went to the, nearly went to the checkout and I realised it was actually 20 items, so I was absolutely gutted. And I never put anything back. Everything I had in my basket, Michelle, is what I purchased. So I do hope you haven't cheated. Uh, but, but anyway, next item is uh, a little cube of toilet rolls, uh, uh, tissue, sorry. And basically what I do with this, I remove this box, I'll bin the box and I use the tissues and put it in another box. So this was 69 pence, good old 69. Um, so pick that one up as well. And then candle, um, this is the Wickford & Co. This is a uh, strawberry eaten mess. The scent, I can't smell it because I'm hay fever. I can smell it a little bit. Um, so I'm not just gonna buy it and just um, hope for the best but these, these are 99 pence um and they've got so many different varieties so i like the jar as well a good size jar so 99 pence for that uh then the next item is some good old fabulosa like again home bargains have got so many different varieties and this is in the scent pineapple and coconut i did manage to smell it yesterday uh and it is a nice smell, obviously it smells like what it says. So, and this was 89 pence for this item as well. Then the next item is, uh, I purchased some of their own Creighton's uh, hand cream. And it was in, the last one I got was in coconut. It is the best hand cream I have used. Literally you put it on, feels a bit rough, but then when it dries, those hands are really smooth. Uh, but this is in the little scent of argan oil. Um, and these were 79 pence for this one. Um, and I did pick up another one in a different scent. Is that what you call it? And this is in the cocoa butter. So this was also 79 pence as well. So picked up two of those. So I've got the argan oil, the cocoa butter. And then in my little drawer, I've got the coconut one. So picked up those as well. Then, need baby wipes, always need baby wipes because I take baby wipes to work from my hands and stuff. Uh, and these were 49 pence for these. So, baby wipes are cheap anyway. And you get, how many did you get in there? 64 in a pack, cheap for 49 pence. So many choices in home bargains. Um, then I grabbed this little hand gel. Uh, they did a few of these and this is in the scent of watermelon. And this is 99 pence. It is antibacterial, but it's only 70%. So better than nothing. And it smells good. So pick that up for 99 pence. 
Then I grabbed some always used scourers. I'm really, I've got two left, so picked up a packet of four, and these was 49 pence for four. Just your basic kitchen item, really. And then I picked up um, popcorn. I've had these for ages. You bang them in your microwave. And this is sweet. I hate salted popcorn. Um, you might as well just dip your hand in a bowl of salt. It's 29p these were. So I thought I was doing really well, I did. Uh, but anyway, 29 pence for that one in the flavour sweet. Then I bought, picked up some little Madeira cakes, little fairy Madeira uh, ice icing cakes you get six in there and they were only 69 pence so it's in these and i thought oh, i'd fancy those yep so 69 pence for those guys then i love smoking bacon crisps good old golden uh, one and these were these were only 95 pence for six um so yeah grab those as well 95 pence for six smoky bacon then the last this item was one pound 49 i love this candle uh, it smells nice actually uh it's i think it's just a vanilla one white ginger sorry uh but i just like the the actual it's glass the glass jar it's like a, a little metallic -y silver uh with that little pattern on as you can see sorry guys this light is really bad uh, but that was the last item guys was one pound 49 now let's get on to the actual result <laughs> So yeah, you guys, you can see the uh, total there, uh, £15.12, I was absolutely gutted at the till, uh, I thought something wasn't right, so I basically checked checked the receipt, I was scouring, I was really, I was, I was going to take it all back and start again, but anyway, £15.12 was my final total, but there was a little catch, because on the receipt, I noticed there was the actual carrier bag on there as well so i thought okay let's deduct what the carrier bag was and the total came to 15 pound and two pence so i missed out on two pence so michelle uh where you are if you are watching i really hope you did as not as bad as me but i, I really hope i beat you by a little fraction but if i haven't then i tried guys it is a, it is actually a hard challenge actually um but yeah i did it the right way so i'm looking forward to your video michelle and guys if you haven't subscribed to michelle uh you guys are you're great subscribers anyway uh make sure you just have a go over to her channel and see what it's about and uh make sure you hit that subscribe button give her a bit of support and michelle congratulations on hitting your thousand uh subscribers it's a good milestone for youtube um but anyway guys so Thanks for watching, bit of fun, hope to uh, collab with Michelle in the future, maybe next month or something, but thanks for watching guys, and if you are new to my channel from Michelle's channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, uh, this come today, but this might have been filmed the other day, so it might be already on my channel, good old Cherry's Hall box, haven't opened it yet, so, um, ooh, I'll uh, do that later, so, anyway guys, stay safe, and I'll catch you guys soon. Yeah.